Alright, hi. I am making this video for Five Awesome Nerds, and it's Friday. This week's theme is CGI, do we like it, and special effects and stuff like that. Well, since I'm a huge um, theater person, and I've been like trained in some aspects of te technical theater. Oh, I'm like 3D. Ooh. Actually, I hate 3D. I think it's, uh, I'm just hoping it's a fad that goes away in the next like 10 years. I know I'll never make things with 3D. I hate 3D so much. It's like the devil. Like Satan's workshop or whatever. But back to my theater training or whatever. I'm trained in... I've actually been semi-trained in um, makeup. So I can, I can do all the super realistic um, cuts and stuff like that. I'm kind of losing my voice because I just got back from my last but win not winter fall homecoming football game. We won um twenty four to fourteen. It's kind of awesome, but yeah, it's really bittersweet. I actually hung out with people that I don't I don't really hung hang out with that much, and it's kind of cool. I'm kind of losing my voice, so it kind of sucks. And I have a my last show as an actor at my high school next Saturday. Kind of sucks. Anyways, um, back to the special effects thing. Um, some special effects I find really cool, like, um, Massive, which is a computer program that you can literally put, like, I'm just gonna do that and go like, wait, wait, there we go. Actually, that still looks really weird, I'm just gonna get a little closer then. And then there's actually a computer programming called, I think it's called Massive, that they used in Lord of the Rings to literally put, like, thousands of people fighting in... Battle scenes, whereas in the 30s and 20s and that 40s era of filmmaking, they would literally get, like, thousands of people into the movie to do ginormous fight scenes and stuff like that. Um, I don't, I'm not a huge fan of 3D, like I said, it's, I think it's a fad, I hope it's a fad. I, it, film is relatively a new art form compared to theater, so they're still toying a lot with what they're doing. Francis Ford Coppola said that at Comic Con this year when he talked, he was talking about his new movie with Elle Fanning and Val Kilmer. But yes, um, what else? Animation. I actually, I, I'm a huge. I'm actually a really big fan of computer animation. Um, I still love traditionally done animation, like drawing, and I love stop motion animation. But computer animation, like Pixar, I love. Like I absolutely adore Pixar. Um, DreamWorks. Uh. Kind of, like, I like the first Shrek. I will, I will probably always love the first Shrek, even though it's not, like, the greatest movie ever, but, I, like, I just love it. And How to Train Your Dragon was really good. It was, that was great. But, yes, I, stop, motion, stop motion and Pixar. I, I love Pixar. And traditional Disney, like, animated movies, absolutely adore, except Realm on the Range. hate that movie so much. It's terrible. But, yeah, um... I'm gonna go, I think. I don't know what else to talk about, really. Um, other than my last show is next week as an actor, and I'm kind of freaking out. It really sucks to think about, but whatever. Oh, I saw. Oh, something else. I saw Dracula today at the, the local junior college, which was. Quite fantastic. Um, my friend Eric, his older brother, who was actually a senior my freshman year, was in it as um, oh, I can't remember his name, but it's the cra it's the guy that um, Lucy, the guy that Lucy like lo is in love with before she becomes a vampire, is, is like about to be married to, who he's studying in the cage and stuff like that. It was, it was a cage when I saw it, but. Yeah, he was absolutely fantastic. Um, it was a lot of the show. Like, it just seemed really lackluster, though, compared to his performance, which was absolutely brilliant. There was one moment in when that was really cool when there was a bed like, on the stage. I'm trying to think, maybe yeah, stage right. Wait, yeah, stage right side of the stage, and I noticed that it looked really weird. Like, it was kind of like weird, like lumpy whatever, and they act this actor laid down on the bed, and then, poof, 
an arm comes off to his side, and then boom, a leg goes out, and then boom, bed head under from underneath the bed, and it's so creepy. The vixens were fantastic. I love the vixens. It seemed like they were crucifying the vampires that whenever they got the the holy cross or whatever, and it was just it was weird. It was an, it was interesting. I'm. But yeah, um, I don't know if next week I'll have a video up on time, cause it's, it's it's a show week and it's my last big show as an actor at my school, like I said. But yeah, um, but yeah, I like some special effects. I hate three D. Love computer animation. Special effects like it's done a lot for movies, but I would really like I prefer movies to not be super laden with special effects everywhere. But that's just me. Except I love some movies that are like entirely special effects. Except for Avatar. Like Scott Pilgrim. Absolutely adore that movie. Oh, that was such a great movie. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna go. This is a six minute long video. <laughs>